good afternoon. Uh, thank you very much for having me on the conference and congratulations for the organization. Um, I'll talk today about some plans that we have for SimChar. First, I'm a software engineer on the development seat. It's a software consulting company. Uh, I've been with Focusit Maps since 2010 and I created the SimChar in 2015. Uh, I, I maintained it from 2017 until 2021 uh, with the support of Mapbox. Uh, also, I worked briefly on Hot. So, when I created the Asimcha, some of the motivations were that it was quite hard to find the problematic chain sets. Um, Sometimes they were specific for a long time on the map. We felt that uh, a lack of control over the data. Uh, at that time, I was just a, a mapper uh, in the Brazilian community with a group of people that was interested in data quality and was trying to review the edits on OSM. So we had lots of difficulties to, to identify the most relevant change that's to be reviewed. Um, so I created something to register the, the change sets from sitmap, uh, make it searchable, uh, and have some, some analysis, some valuable flagging uh, that we run automatically and input some information on each change set to like, provide some, some tips of what could be wrong on that change set. And also, we have a very nice map visualization. It also provides a REST API um, that can be used to integrate it with other tools. We have some integration with MapRoulette, uh, allowing to uh, get some flagged features from SimChar and input it directly on some uh, MapRoulette challenge. Uh, and it's all open source. It's hosted by Mobox since 2015. Um, SMT is used by lots of communities around the world and also by lots of companies uh, like Mobox, Apple, Facebook, Microsoft, Lyft, and some others. It's, the, I believe, the most convenient tool for the same communities to track the change sets. Uh, we have a lot of resources that don't exist on the sim.org website. Also, it makes it possible to, to, to check if the chain set was already reviewed or not. So when you are viewing a, a chain set, you can say that it's good or it's not good. And other users can see that information. Uh, also, we have a very good use case of using our API that is the Ersim Welcome tool, which was developed by Ersim Belgium to start to discover what are the new users. Uh, it can be used not, not only in Belgium, but in, in any part of the world. You subscribe and uh, register a region that you want to monitor, and you discover the new users that in that area, and they allow you uh, they allow you to send a message to, to each user. Also, two companies that uh, use Ascentia in addition to the internal tools. Uh, it's a, an opportunity to have a central repository of validated chain sets. So uh, the companies can share that data. Uh, it can also increase the transparency and the collaboration between companies and the communities. So, uh, anyone can, can view what, what any other user reviewed and have like some, some consensus about uh, the, the quality. And also it can open the possibility to, to provide training data to machine learning models and to make it the, the, the review process faster and easier. So entering on the path of uh, the future of Asimcha, right now uh, I'm working with Development Seed. Uh, so the company is very interested in, in putting more work on Asim software. We have uh, 
great track record of some software that was built by the World Seed, like the Ocean Teams, uh, the scoreboard that uh, was made by two youth mappers, I believe, or two maxa, maybe, I'm not sure. The Open Aero Map, uh, which was made by Too, Too Hot, and we have some work also with Open Historical Map and a prototype of a mobile editor named Observe. So we are very interested in working more with some projects and we have uh, a very experienced OSM team, uh, like people like Sajad, Sanjay, uh, Mark, uh, that have uh, a lot of knowledge about SITMAP. So uh, right now we are doing a work to Wikimedia Italia, uh, making a, a new feature to OSM chat that Maybe it's the most asked feature uh, that people always ask is if it's possible to find the chain sets that curated, edited, or deleted uh, features with some tags. Like, for example, you want to know all the chain sets that touch some shop bicycles, some bicycle shops. Uh, or, for example, all the chain sets that edited highways. Uh, well, we, we are right now working on that feature. I think in one or two months we can release it. First we'll test it with a small region of the world and then uh, try to release it globally. Um, so yes, uh, during this year, the uh, World Seed is committed to dedicate some, some time to our Sencha, but we would like also find organizations interested in funding some development. Um, some of our, our roadmap is first assure the continuity of the service. Uh, sometimes we have some problems, for example, in with overpass, uh, and as we don't have anyone dedicated to specifically to SMCHAR, it can take some time to, to fix it, and also assure that uh, Mabox or someone else we will continue hosting the service for the community. Also improve the database performance as the data grew a lot in the last years. Uh, the, the database has some performance problems. We need to, to make it, to allow the users to find the chain sets that interest them. And uh, we, we need to increase the, the performance of the API in general. Also improve the quality of the flags to the chain sets. Um, we have some ideas to implement a, a rating system to make it easier to the users to prioritize some chain sets to review. Also the localization of the interface that it's only available in English right now. Some other second level priorities. Uh, so some tech debt and keep the software stack Updated. Also, as we we also have in the seeds uh, some machine learning teams, uh, we'd like to, to make some achievements to it with it. Uh, explore some some integrations uh, with some teams, and also the, the filters page. We have a lot of possibilities to filter the chain sets by but the that we take criteria to filter the chain sets so. The, the filter space needs to be improved to make it easier to the users. And we also are open to new ideas uh, of uh, what could be done. So if you have some interest, uh, you can contact me and or contact anyone in the seat. My contact. Uh, thank you very much for your time, and if you have some questions. Okay. Yes. Okay.